What's going on guys? Mitch here, starting the vlog from the road today. And let me tell you, it looks like it's gonna rain. <laughs> and in fact, it did earlier. So we're going out on a pretty casual, easy, easy, relaxing recovery ride, which is what I'm now known for apparently. So I started my day off this morning on the trainer while it was raining out and uh, it just, the sun came out and dried things off and I just want to get a total cash ride in to enjoy the summer more than anything. <laughs> you know, I'm filming this right now. It's the end of end of June, actually. And uh, I can see the end. It's sad as it is living in Canada. I guess that's one thing that uh, I don't do a good enough job of telling you that I am Canadian and we are coming up on the July Canada Day, July 1st, which is obviously before the Americans I think July 4th, so I, I, I see the end <laughs> in sight, sadly. So I have to take advantage when I have a nice day and an opening. Yes, I've got the mileage in already today, but sometimes you just need to go out and enjoy why it is that we go ride. It's not about intervals. It's not about PRs. It's not about average speed. It's literally just about enjoying the ride on a day that it might actually pour, as you can see behind me. Ugh. Anyway, we're gonna go out. I got a lot to talk about on these types of vlogs because let's be honest, my heart rate isn't high and my lips move at a record pace when I'm not breathing heavily. This right Chasing stars and holding view I can't see the end But we'll see it through There's a guy in the river fishing Hopefully gonna catch a supper Maybe I'll have to stop by on the way back And learn how to start a fire and bring oil and garlic. So anyway, as I said, today is very light. I'm actually consciously trying to not go over 200 watts. And honestly, I think vlogging helps me with that because I don't push when I vlog because I can't talk. <laughs> so, so that's why you guys tend to get rest days, but that's all good. I've tried filming on days that uh, are heavy interval days, heavy training days, I just can't like it's I don't have I don't have the time because you're pushing so hard and you can't really talk you can't you, you can't stay stay on point with a topic like I can on a day like today where I could literally vlog for half an hour or an hour and maintain like right now this guy is doing a u-turn in the middle of a of the road It's just the shit I see all the time. Like, it's just constant here. Oh my God, the sky is so dark. I was watching one of my buddy's shorts. He went to uh, Canmore Banff. They went for a ride and it was claimed to be such a nice day. And, uh, oh my God, he got poured on. It just looked horrendous. Horrendous. But yeah, look, look what I'm looking at here. I think I might, I might be getting the same thing, unfortunately. So what is on the menu for you guys today? Well, I'll tell you this. One, uh, I ordered a bunch of new ASO stuff. I've been really, really impressed with the Mil GTOs and the Mil GTS bibs for summer that I have. And I'm now three years into the GTOs. I've been so impressed with the, uh, the Mil GTOs over the last little while that uh, I did decide to order some new bibs. And they say on, on ASO stuff, you know, I, I don't know the approximate life that you get out of them, but I will say that it's been three years and maybe I'll do a video at some point showing what heavily used three-year-old bibs look like compared to new ones. 
But I did try the ASOS Equip RS and really, really liked it to the point where I wanted to order a couple more pairs and kind of transition into that for my training rides. So I'll show you those when I get home. I have a couple new pairs or I think I'll show you when I get home. If I remember, if I have battery left. But otherwise, really excited about them. All right guys, so what was a nice day? It's starting to turn real shitty. So I'm gonna cut to when I'm home. I'll show you some ASO stuff because it's just too windy and there's no way you can hear this. Cause, and it's about to start pouring, I think. Look at this. See you back at home. All right guys, so I'm back home from the ride. It went awesome other than it started to rain and uh, here we are. It wasn't the most ideal situation, but that's fine. Um, to wrap things up, I did want to show you some of the ASO stuff. So this is what we will have coming up. I'm assuming by the time you see this vlog, this will probably be on the channel, but some gloves to replace my current, uh, current ASOS gloves. And then another couple, uh, another couple sets of Equip RS bibs uh, for me. So I'm excited to transition those into the trainering bibs just because they're a little thinner, lighter, and less padding, so it's more of a trainer style bib or a race bib, I guess you could say. But uh, excited to try those out and, and integrate that more into the routine. Otherwise, I'm gonna get my smoothie on and continue on with the day. I hope you guys had a great Canada, uh, Canada day by the time you see this, probably be a month later, but uh, that's all good. Uh, otherwise, have yourselves a good week and we will see you on Thursday. See you guys.